Congress is about to debate authorization of use of military force so the president can wage war against ISIS. It's a huge debate about what to do. Some liberals are afraid to give the president any war-making authority. They're skeptical about that. Some conservatives want to give the president very robust war-making authority. Listen to Ed Royce here. He's the chairman of the House Foreign Relations Committee, speaking on Hugh Hewitt. He wants to go, he's thinking about it. He thinks it would be a good idea to go even beyond a war against ISIS. Do you personally, I don't know what the committee will do, but would you support giving the president the explicit authority to strike at the Iranian nuclear capacity if they do not abandon it themselves? I think it is a good idea, and I will tell you, Hugh, that there are two jihads going on. One of them is the ISIS jihad, which you and I are familiar with. Uh, the other is something that's not being talked about that much, but that is the jihad that's coming out of Iran. The, the jihad coming out of Iran. Yes, they support Hamas, they support Hezbollah, they support other uh, very unhelpful, to be polite, players in, <laughs> right. in, in, the, in the Middle East. Uh, but is this Congress going to, in this resolution that they can't agree on anyway, just specifically about ISIS, going to include Iran? No, and this is the fear that, that a lot of people have about the, you know, sort of an open-ended AUMF, that it's a slippery slope. But the other thing about Iran is that I believe Iran is going after ISIS, so it would be weird in this uh, AMUF that's going after ISIS to then go after Iran, which is also in some ways coordinating with us and trying to de defeat ISIS. Yeah, I don't think Congress is going to pass a resolution authorizing the president to strike Iran. That's <laughs> right. probably not very likely. That's yeah. one, one set of powers he does that well. But it does show you it does show you ideologically the shifts between the most conservative members who need to debate this and the liberal members who need to debate this, which tells me that it's going to be interesting to watch to see if they can come up with a final Consensus. product, a final yeah. product that the president likes. Yeah.